Previously on the Dana Beer Super Senior Selection Tour presented by Pink Whitney. My name is Dana Beers, and I'm looking for a college to root for for the rest of my life. First off, Lubbock, Texas. But I feel at home. I feel at home, man. I'm gonna go right in Bebo's face and get my horns down. <laughs> Landed in the fine state of Ohio. It's cold. My good friend Corey G. He's like the most jacked dude on the planet. Uh, he said he wanted us to stop by. I just wanted to go to the zoo. I'm not really happy about this development, but we're going to the gym. Ohio State tonight. Cincinnati tomorrow. We don't have to drive eight hours overnight. O H I O. Beautiful in the fall, Ohio. I didn't know what to expect. I've never been to Ohio. This is nice. I had a lot of people calling out my weight in this puppy here. I gotta get some reps. Good to see you too. Appreciate you guys coming out. This is Glenn. What's up, Glennie? Corey. Glenn, nice to meet you. Glennie, Glennie, Glennie. Yeah. Oh. I want you to do just a little bit of warm up. I'm going to dunk all over Glenn. I would fucking hope so. You're seven feet tall. Mine's heavier. There it is. I know mine's heavier, right? I'm already winded. <laughs> One set of ten. Okay. One set of ten. It's all good. All good. All right. Yeah. I'm a fucking athlete down in here. I'm fucking popping my ass, bro. Yeah. Like, <laughs> popping his ass. I'm fucking Jersey Turn popping all over here, dog. This is the new act. Not in a muscly Not. way. Hey, you're popping though. You know how many of us are good? Three, two, time to fucking ball. Fucking ball. Yeah. Oh! 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 Shit. I'm speechless. That was, that was pretty cool, right? Like I used to. We're gonna wipe this footage. We're gonna wipe all of it. You don't want me in the post. Oh, you like that? Oh, 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 I thought I had a poster. Oh, I don't care if we lost. We can end it now. I don't care if we lost. I had three highlights. Yeah, I mean, shout out Corey. This place is sick. We all know what I'm gonna be showing when I edit this video. That last block, that was Dana B. Hingham Harborman, 2011. Average 12 points and 10 rebounds a game, yeah. You forget about the blocks per game. 1.5 blocks per game. Crushed it, crushed it. Now introducing the double-double king of the South Shore. Number three in your program, number one in your hearts, Dana B. <laughs> uh, it was good, man. That was yeah. Appreciate it. Hey, I appreciate ours. We're going to the fucking zoo. We're going to the highlight of the fucking day, is what we're I believe after San Diego Zoo, it's the best zoo in the country. So this is the big day. This ain't no bronze zoo. It's just a parking zoo. Ain't nobody zoos have a lot this big, no. This ain't no bronze zoo. This ain't no queen zoo in Flesh and Meadows Corner Park that I grew up going to. Where the main attraction was a fucking black bear. Let's go see some motherfucking animals, bitch. I love how excited he is. He's a simple man. He knows what he wants. What? What? I'm Egyptian, I need to see fucking camels. When's the hibernation period for these animals? Like, are the bears gonna be hibernating their dicks? Right, what the prairie dog? Prairie dog is when you have to shit. Most golden bear I've ever met. I think one you should apply for, for his next job. The conductor of that train. My Egyptian brothers. What's up, boys? What's up, boys? Oh, he's pissing. This is piss dogs. Yeah. Let's go. It's a good stream. What's up, like, Dana, you can piss your bed once a quarter, I'll piss for you. Those things are great. Fucking ugly, I'm sorry. They almost have heads as big as fucking Smitty. 
They really made Timon look way better than that. Or was he cool? Wasn't there a hot warthog in a lion kid? Oh no, I'm thinking of Nala. Nala <laughs> fucking <laughs> rocket. <laughs> <laughs> this is the money maker. This is how you pay the fucking bills. They absolutely move the needle. This is the good stuff. Oh, please get up, please get up, please get up. Look at his ass, look at his ass. Yes. This is what I feel like when people come up to me at a bar and ask me to do the beer tweet. I'm just a monkey in a cage. The guy's fucking, he's slinging a hog. It's a good piece. I call this the, are you taller than White Sox Dave station. I just can't stop thinking about how drunk I'm gonna get at the women's volleyball game. You should learn how to respect women and not get drunk at their games and watch their sport. Because I would get drunk at a men's game. I am equally respecting women. Checkmate beers. I'm gonna delete beers. We're in La La Land on this side of the court. We got spikes in our fucking face, on our lap, and our knees. We're giving them meatballs. I think this is gonna be a bloodbath. We got dinner reservations at ATT, I hope so. Bloodbath! Guys counted chicken before they have. You literally can't win all the points. That's what I've always said. I'm just as nervous right now as when I knew I was going on the Jumbotron at game six of the NBA Finals. Cheer, cheer, go, go, go. There wasn't much of a pop there. Some people are calling it the Dana Beers curse of the Jumbotron. Anybody's ball game right now. They keep feeding those meatballs. They're gonna see what happens. I'm on a fair weather Ohio State women's volleyball fan. We just have obligations to go to. I mean, it's to fucking eat. When I went on the Jumbotron, everything went downhill, so we have places to be. Okay, I gotta be like all the YouTubers. Take a break real quick and say subscribe. It takes literally one second. Help me be a YouTube megastar and it's just sail off into the sunset. Please subscribe. It takes one second. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. All right. Back to the absolute madness. We just finished up at a beautiful dinner where I had about 13,000 dumplings. I, uh, and now we're getting on a, a bus. Fucking wit dog owes me probably 300,000 based on all the fucking exposure I'm giving him. Bang, bang, bang. Oh, look at this, a chariot rise. A chariot rise. Ow! Oh, fuck! Bloody balls! <laughs> She said she too young, no one, no man. So she gon' call her friends and that's a plan. I'm just a monkey in a cage. You Ohioans are weirdos, but I love it. Yeah, like, super super well, but I want to reiterate, I'm too old for this shit. She gon' catch a Who has cigarettes? I don't know how I'm gonna put on my drinking shoes and go out there in Cincinnati and have a performance, but I'm gonna do it. I'm coming, Cincy. Come. And New York's got her pizza pie. Cincinnati's famous for her skyline. Skyline chilies. We are live in Cincinnati, Pink Whitney. I'm Dana Bears. For those that don't know, I'm trying to pick a school to be a fan of for the rest of my life. Cincinnati's on the list. We are the greatest school in history! Catch my fucking 90, baby, let's go!
the fuck is that? Why should I be a fan of the Cincinnati Bearcats for the rest of my life? Why should I root for the Cincinnati Bearcats? Last year, playoffs. The fucking Bearcats! The dork, it's sweet and spicy, goodness can't be beat. Cincinnati's famous skyline. Uh, we out here, it's game day. We're about to fuck up the, uh, who are we playing? TCU, we about to fuck up TCU! Dana! Can I say, uh, KB, if you're watching this, I love you. He has answered my DMs before, so he must like fat asses. Cigarette! It's Siggy time, baby. Why should I pick Cincinnati? It's the Bearcats fuck. I'm here live with Bumpus. Bumpus! Really? Let's go! What would you say to someone who says any college can say the best part is the drinking culture? Tell them to suck a dick and come to Cincy. What's the best part about Cincinnati? To Skyline, I'm as This is awesome! I've narrowed down a list of five schools that I'm trying to root for for the rest of my life. Yeah. Since he's on there. Say it right now. Oh, um, since he's number one. Yeah! <laughs> There's no denying oh, it. I'm fucking wasted. You match the car. Oh, it's so I look you like that's so fucking good. Stage talking to those guys before, and he was making fun of me for not drinking. And he was like, Oh, you can't go thinking that. You can't go thinking that. And we got back here from Skyline Chile at 7 o'clock exactly. It is now 7 35. Not answering his phone, I answered the door. So it looks like someone took a nap and fell asleep. Dana! You're going with that night. I set my alarm for 7.30 a.m. <laughs> instead of p.m. That's on me. 